Hi, my name is Raniel Adamolu, and I am a seventh grade integrated reading and writing teacher at Ali Middle School. Um, I also teach STEM, so that's kind of teaching the integration of 21st century skills um, into the reading and writing curriculum. So science, technology, engineering, and math. So yes, my husband is in the US Army. He's stationed overseas. Um, he's been stationed for about, over there for about four years now. Um, um, and I try to go and visit him as often as I can. Um, we have no children. Um, my students are my children um, and they keep me very, very busy. Um, let's see what else. I don't have any, I guess, hobbies. Grad school has kind of taken over my entire life right now. So I'm just like work, home, study, sleep. That's about it. So um, as far as our discussion, so our first uh, discuss, the, the first discussion question posed is um, for us to discuss how generational characteristics uh, impact the way we teach. Um, I'm a millennial. And one of the things that the video outlined that was a characteristic of a, of a millennial is that we're very tech savvy, which I absolutely agree with. I think that being a, a millennial and growing up when like, you know, the Mac, I remember like when the Macintosh first came out and all this other great stuff, you know, we wanted to know what it was about and how to use it. And so that's carried over into my adult life. Um, another thing that they mentioned, another characteristic that they mentioned about millennials was that or that the video mentioned was that we are very social people. We like to work with groups. We like to work together. We like to work in teams, um, which I can absolutely agree to as well. Definitely like to work in, you know, talk and socialize as I'm getting my work done. So, um, and I think that impacts the way that I teach because I am a person, I do let my students talk a lot in class. I let them work in groups. I let them work with partners. Um, I let them share their ideas. So that definitely much is, uh, is definitely reflected in uh, my classroom uh, whenever anyone comes in to observe. They notice like, oh, there's a lot of talking, but there's a lot of le uh, learning going on. Um, technology, um, I do incorporate the use of a lot of technology in my class from laptops to phones um, to letting them do research on their own on topics that they don't understand or topics that I've taught. Um, just because I'm a person that can appreciate technology and well and all the wonderful things that um, you can do with it. So um, I think that it has really, you know, those, that's how those characteristics impact my teaching. Um, I think it's positive. I think it's positive because I'm a millennial. All of my students are millennials. And so since they're millennials, um, I feel like we kind of relate. I'm still definitely old to them. Like, oh, you're almost on a millennial, you know? So I'm old to them. But, you know, I still, you know, know my stuff a little bit. I know my way around a cell phone and an app and a laptop and a tablet. So um, I think that, you know, so because I know that, um, they can, I can kind of let them and understand how they want to use it or why they want to use it or why they always want to go to it when they encounter an issue. So I think it's been a, po it's had a positive impact, um, on the way that I teach. And so our last question is, um, what changes do I need to make in order to meet the student? Um, I really wouldn't make any changes. I, um, think that I'm a pretty good teacher, hopefully, um, with, um, tech, letting them utilize technology because that is the way of the future and also uh, letting them speak with one another gives them an opportunity to collaborate all the time so I think that's great as well um, so those are some of the 21st century, uh, 21st century skills that I try to teach every day collaboration um, communication critical thinking all of that good stuff so yeah um, the only thing I think I would change is that Right now, I really don't make an effort to go out and seek out the newest um, advances in technology, I guess. Kind of let it fall into my lap, like, oh, what does this do? You know, I think I should be more purposeful because I know these there are new apps and new things to incorporate onto phones and technology that my students are really up on. And I probably don't know as much as I would know if I was actively pursuing or purposefully trying to find out, find out those things. 
So I think that that's probably one thing I could improve on, just being more purposeful and um, really going out and see what's out there and seeing what students can utilize and seeing what they are utilizing so that I can meet them and their various needs. Thank you for watching my video.